Reactions as photo of Fusi Banjo with the new King of England so faces online. Welcome to the news and please subscribe to our channel. To get notified when we post hot juicy news update, please click on the notification bell. Recently, new picture of Vice President of Nigeria, Yemi Osibanjo with the new King of England surfaced on social media. The picture was posted on the official Twitter account of Laolu Akande. The scribe shots and the post results. Pic shows VP last night with King Charles and Buckingham reception of Queen's funeral today. VP says a historic event. Just the share and amenity and the gathering of leaders from everywhere. The goodwill, the good wishes and all of that from practically everywhere around the world. While releasing the picture, he added that he had a caption that reads, Vice President last night with King Charles at Buckingham reception of Queen's funeral today. As expected, a few minutes ago, after his pictures of face on social media, his supporters and so many Twitter users who came across it rushed down to the comment section box and dropped their reactions from different perspectives. Some of the reaction they threw the post goes thus. All I see was two great men engaging themselves. Keep representing us well, Mr. VP. Congratulations to the royal family on the successful funeral of Queen Elizabeth II and another opinion. Now, um, let me say this. Sincerely, I heard that Bubu, the president, Mr. Muhammad Buhari, is actually out of town. And then that he was attending an event somewhere and he sent Vice President Usibanjo to this place. And I was beginning to wonder because if nobody says this seems wrong in this, then there's a problem. Why will a president, hmm? that is moving out of a country, send or delegate, you know, powers for to his VP to represent him at another function, leaving the country, like leaving this country for more than 24 hours on autopilot. People came out and like, you know, even if they did, nothing will happen. Even if only Shiban Usiban Jodi, nothing will happen. And people are like, you know, he has been traveling without even delegating parts. Like it's not like he has been traveling and delegating. Like he has been traveling and he has not been delegating powers. I'm like, what? And we have a Senate president who is obviously we have people in the National Assembly who is obviously aware and they're allowing him to jet in and out of a country? Nah, sincerely. You see why I say these people, they are just there to warm our benches. No, 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 no. Because if you ask me, where would have attended this event? Hmm? Continue attending your whatever, if you like, go to the mass. That is, when you're leaving, you dedicate, I mean, you... You delegate duties to the VP to be done. Or you delegate some powers to himself. So he can actually do something before he comes back. Because this part of, you know, him leaving the country all by ourselves. We are leaving that all by ourselves. So I'm telling you, as I'm talking to you now, we are left all by ourselves. If something happened now, nothing is accountable. Nobody accountable for it. And you know, why I feel this is strange is because why then go see me go see when you travel out of a country? And Buhari is also out of a country. To me, I see a whole lot going here. I see a lot. I feel me, I smell fish. If Nigeria, if not they bothered about this thing, I am sincerely bothered about it. Because go wrong now. It's just like, Mother and father, they left their children 
unattended and they travel both of them they left her in the hands of people whom they practically knew will not be able or and not are incapable of taking care of them that is how i see this <laughs> to be very sincere with you Usi Banjo is a presidential material, but see the way he was ejected due to Emilio Considium. Go to visit and share the memory pics with King Charles. A coward, a weakling, he remained in Yoruba with not a single understanding of the sensibility of other tribes, and a corrupt Usi Banjo with a wicked moral fiber is touted as a presidential material. He cannot withstand 1% pressure from the Northerners. Hmm. Uh, well, I no blame I no blame this person, Sha. I said a person will be a shoe. Now I know you are the premier. Usiba and just showed that he was a very good presidential material at what certain time Buhari travelled outside the country and delegated duties to him. I think that was 2015, 2016, or was it 2017? The man did something that everybody was proud of. The man was like you know, we were like, make this man even travel all the time so that we are going to be having moments with this man like this. But unfortunately, immediately we, Baba, we, Bubu, came back and learned about what he did. I mean, the man stopped delegating powers to him when he travels. And I'm still asking the National Assembly, is this supposed to be making sense because Kuyemio, it does not make sense to me. It certainly does not make sense to me. Why will Sibanjo be around and the president will be traveling and there will be no delegation of duties? Huh. Well, so me, I don't see a weak person in Sibanjo. I do not, to be, to be very honest with you. But we need somebody very legit. We need somebody who will not be intimidated. The person will come in and, you know, do the need for. All right. These people knows what they are doing. See how they send the wise person to represent Nigeria. <laughs> they want to mortgage the future of the youth and the children in this country. Osiba Enjoy is truly a presidential material with the capacity to encourage engage even the King of England in a meaningful discussion. Underline this with the capacity to engage the Queen of England in a meaningful discussion. But it is rather unfortunate that his chance of becoming the president is truncated by the ambition of some lily livered and weak candidates who cannot represent us well in the public fora. Hmm. It can only remind me about those things, I beg. So, Sibanjo, sincerely, you would have been a better candidate. Hmm. Yeah, just maybe. But the thing is, a lot of people are doubting if he's going to be half that dodgedness to handle Nigeria. Alright, so this note we've come to the end of the news. We say thank you for today.